My beloved child, I love you with a love that is eternal, unwavering, and steadfast. In moments of doubt and suffering, know that I am with you, guiding and embracing you. Do not seek validation from those who do not cherish your heart. Instead, let me be the ruler of your heart, and you will find true peace. You can donate a super thanks to support our channel. I have seen your tears and felt your pain. Come to me and I will give you rest. Even when you stumble, I will not turn you away, for you are precious to me. Your life is changing in miraculous ways, and soon you will see the path to freedom from your suffering. Remember, I have always been with you, even in your darkest hours. I have been your guide leading you back to the light. The dream I have placed within you is blossoming, and it will not only nourish you but also those you love. Hold fast to the life I offer, for greater things are in store for you. Do not be afraid of the challenges you face. These trials are preparing you for greater blessings. I know your pain and suffering and I am here to bring peace to your soul and comfort to your heart. Reflect on our journey together and see that all I have done is for your good. Be patient with yourself and receive my peace. Soon your sorrow will end and your needs will be fulfilled. Do not be anxious, for I am with you. I will strengthen you and uphold you. Your future will be bright and your wounds will heal. Move forward with the lessons from your past, and rest in my arms when you are weary. Amen. You are sincere and good, despite the hurt you have endured. You gave love even when you had nothing left to give. The pains of your past will not return, for I am leading you on a better path. Trust in me, and I will guide you. Embrace my word and know me more. A new stage of your life is unfolding, free from past afflictions. When you cry, it will be from seeing my promises fulfilled. Listen for my Holy Spirit, breathing life, love, and hope into your being. I am working in your life, and I will give you victory. You are a champion, a warrior, a conqueror, and an overcomer. I strengthen and empower you. I hear your cries and respond to your prayers. My love for you will never waver. You are my child and you will do miraculous works through your devotion to me. Press onward, for I am generous and provide all things. Your prayers and courage bring blessings. Cherish the life you have been given, and I will ensure you have everything you desire. Listen to me daily and open your spirit to faith and hope. No one can overcome you, for my love is with you. You are courageous and resilient. Follow my commands, guard my words, and always think of me. Open your eyes, ears, and heart to receive me. Trust me like a child, and I will provide. Bring me your faith, and I will bless you abundantly. The world is filled with anxiety, but you have a God who loves you. I have chosen you for your simple heart. And though you have been hurt, you have not fallen away from me. Hold on to your faith. Pray with me daily and make time to sit with me in stillness. Great things are about to happen in your life, beyond your wildest dreams. I am opening doors you thought were closed. My words and promises are true, and I will bless you until you have no more tears of disappointment. Stand beside me and look to the horizon. Your dreams will be realized and your joy will be complete. I am here watching over you by night and day. Trust in my designs and know that every word I say to you is a foundation for your life. Be not afraid, for I am with you. Your future is bright and your blessings are many. Rejoice, for I am your God and I will never leave you. I have seen your tears, heard your cries, and felt the weight of your burdens. Know this, I am with you always and my love for you is unchanging and eternal. 
When you feel overwhelmed, remember that I am your refuge and strength, an ever-present help in trouble. Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. My yoke is easy and my burden is light. Let go of the heavy loads you carry and allow me to bear them for you. In your moments of doubt, trust in my promises. I have plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. Hold on to this truth and let it anchor your soul. Though the storms may rage around you, you will not be shaken, for I am your solid rock and foundation. Do not be disheartened by the trials you face. These are but a momentary affliction, preparing you for an eternal glory that far outweighs them all. Fix your eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen. For what is seen is temporary, but what is unseen is eternal. I am the vine, you are the branches. If you remain in me and I in you, you will bear much fruit. Apart from me, you can do nothing. Stay connected to me through prayer, meditation, and the study of my word. Let my words abide in you, and you will ask what you desire, and it shall be done for you. Your life has purpose and meaning. I have called you by name and you are mine. Before you were born, I knew you and set you apart for great things. Walk in the path I have laid out for you and do not be afraid. I am with you, guiding your steps and lighting your way. When you face opposition, remember that I am your defender and protector. No weapon formed against you shall prosper and every tongue that rises against you in judgment you shall condemn. You are more than a conqueror through me who loves you. Let my peace, which transcends all understanding, guard your heart and mind. Be still and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations. I will be exalted in the earth. Rest in my love and trust in my timing. I am working all things together for your good. In the times when you feel alone, know that I am near. I will never leave you nor forsake you. You are precious to me and I delight in you. Take refuge in my arms and find comfort in my presence. I am your loving father and you are my cherished child. Lift up your eyes and see the new things I am doing. Do not dwell on the past or be held captive by former things. I am making a way in the wilderness and streams in the wasteland. Your future is bright and the best is yet to come. Rejoice in the hope I have given you. Be patient in affliction and faithful in prayer. Let your light shine before others that they may see your good deeds and glorify your Father in heaven. You are my ambassador, my representative, my beloved. Remember, I am with you always, even to the end of the age. You are never alone. You are deeply loved, highly favored, and abundantly blessed. Walk in my grace, live in my love, and shine with my light. When you feel discouraged, remember that my strength is made perfect in your weakness. My grace is sufficient for you. Lean on me and I will carry you through every trial and tribulation. You do not have to face anything alone, for I am your ever-present help in times of need. In moments of confusion, seek my wisdom. I give generously to all without finding fault and it will be given to you. Trust in me with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge me, and I will make your path straight. Amen. Embrace the peace I offer you, a peace that the world cannot give. Let my peace rule in your heart and be thankful. Cast all your anxiety on me because I care for you. Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition with thanksgiving, present your requests to me. 
and my peace, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds. Cherish the joy that comes from knowing me. The joy of the Lord is your strength. Delight yourself in me, and I will give you the desires of your heart. Sing and make music from your heart to me, always giving thanks for everything in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. You are fearfully and wonderfully made. Marvel at the work of my hands, for you are my masterpiece, created in Christ Jesus to do good works, which I prepared in advance for you to do. Do not be afraid to step out in faith and pursue the dreams I have placed in your heart. With me, all things are possible. Surround yourself with the community of believers, for where two or three gather in my name, there am I with them. Encourage one another and build each other up. Carry each other's burdens, and in this way you will fulfill the law of Christ. Love one another deeply from the heart. Remember that nothing can separate you from my love. Neither death nor life, neither angels nor demons, neither the present nor the future, nor any powers, neither height nor depth, nor anything else in all creation, will be able to separate you from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. Live in the freedom I have given you. It is for freedom that Christ has set us free. Stand firm then, and do not let yourselves be burdened again by a yoke of slavery. You are free to love, free to serve, and free to live the abundant life I have promised you. As you journey through life, be a light in the darkness. Let your light shine before others, that they may see your good deeds and glorify your Father in heaven. Be the salt of the earth, preserving what is good and adding flavor to the world around you. Lastly, always remember that I love you with an everlasting love. My thoughts towards you are precious and outnumber the grains of sand. You are my treasured possession, and I am your God. Rest in my love, trust in my promises, and know that you are never alone. As you go forward, hold fast to the truth of my word. My word is a lamp for your feet and a light for your path. Meditate on it day and night and let it dwell in you richly. Through my word you will find wisdom, guidance, and strength for every situation you encounter. Be vigilant and steadfast in your faith. The enemy prowls around like a roaring lion seeking whom he may devour. Resist him, standing firm in the faith, knowing that you are not alone in your struggles. I have equipped you with the armor of God, the belt of truth, the breastplate of righteousness, the gospel of peace on your feet, the shield of faith, the helmet of salvation, and the sword of the Spirit which is my word. Pray continually, being watchful and thankful. Come to me with all your concerns, for I am your loving Father who delights in hearing from you. Pray in the Spirit on all occasions with all kinds of prayers and requests. With this in mind, be alert and always keep on praying for all the Lord's people. Seek to grow in grace and in the knowledge of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Study the scriptures, engage in fellowship with other believers, and be diligent in seeking my face. Through this, you will become more like my Son, bearing the fruit of the Spirit. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Serve others with the gifts I have given you. Each of you should use whatever gift you have received to serve others as faithful stewards of my grace in its various forms. Whether you speak, serve, or give, do it all in the strength I provide, so that in all things I may be praised through Jesus Christ. In times of prosperity, do not forget me. Acknowledge that every good and perfect gift comes from above, from the Father of lights. Give thanks in all circumstances and honor me with your wealth, with the first fruits of all your produce. Share your blessings with those in need. 
and you will be storing up treasures in heaven. In times of suffering, trust that I am working all things together for your good. Though you may not understand why you are going through certain trials, know that I am with you, refining you like gold in the fire. Your faith, being tested, will result in praise, glory, and honor when Jesus Christ is revealed. Rest in my sovereignty. I am the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. I hold all things in my hands and nothing happens outside of my will. Be still and know that I am God. Trust in my timing and in my plans for you. For they are plans to prosper you and not to harm you. Plans to give you hope 